Hey there, happy Advent. As I promised for the youth Sunday school during Advent, we will be looking at the birth of Jesus as it's told throughout the scripture. And so today we're starting in Luke's gospel. So if you've got your Bible, turn to it. If you want to pull up Bible Gateway and look it up, you can do that too. Luke, and we're looking at Luke chapter 1, verses 5 through 24, uh, 5 through 25. And I will um, allow you to read that for yourselves. So the gist of it um, is that um, there was a priest who um, had a wife and neither of them had they been they had not been able to have any kids and he was getting older and they went to the temple to pray and um, when he was praying um, he saw an angel and the angel said don't be afraid your wife is going to get pregnant and have a son and you're going to name him john and uh he was like um i don't think so uh, she's pretty old and so the angel's like well it's going to happen, and because you didn't uh, believe, you won't get to talk until he's born. And so the um, the man and his goes home to his wife, um, and they get pregnant, and then um, what is foretold happens. And so um, this is the, the fulfill the scripture and the prophecy about um, uh, John the Baptist comes to prepare the way for the Lord. And so... Um, this is sort of the beginning of Advent. We look at John the Baptist because he prepares the way. And so Advent for us is a preparation of ourselves for a time of a new thing. And so John the Baptist um, is the one who's going to sort of set the scene for Jesus. And so in Luke's gospel, we get a very detailed story about his birth and how he comes um, into the world and what that looks like, that there is an angelic interference, God blessing someone with a child, um, very similarly kind of to Mary, but sort of different in terms of age and things of that nature. And so, um, you know, it, it just really parallels a lot of what we're going to see happen with Jesus um, and his mom, Mary, uh, except, you know, that obviously it's not, um, John is not the son of God, but he is a prophet and a holy man. And so, um, you know, as you read that, I want you to keep in mind some of the things that might sound similar to Christmas to you. Um, there's prayers. Um, there's this can't be happening. There's an angel saying, be not afraid. Um, and, you know, God, God intervening in the world to do something, you know, miraculous. And so we give thanks for that. And that's what we are looking at here. So spend some time and read through this. Uh, Luke chapter 1, 5 through 25 and kind of see uh, what stands out to you as you read it. And next week, we'll really start hearing about um, Jesus as we get into further into Luke and look at um, the prophecies about his birth and what all that is going to look like with angels getting involved in the world and the promise of Jesus the Christ. But for today, we get this sort of parallel story that is John the Baptist and who he's going to be and his own miraculous coming into the world. So thanks for listening, and I hope you have a great Sunday.